let's try lightning bow and boy. Good. Good speedy cat. Oh, I don't know, the plasma fall, sure. Oh wait, I was gonna see the new core I got. Oh god damn it. Oh, we're gonna be in a sandstorm. Let's just stick with the turbo core. It's turbo time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <sighs> Excuse me. Oh, where credits are due? You know, so if your NPC dudes kill people, it also counts. That's cool. The sandstorm's blocking off our field of view. Don't let your guard down. Use the sandstorm as cover to approach enemy base. Okay. The enemies will have a hard time detecting you, but at the same time, your vision will be hampered. So be careful. Can't see anything. Now we can complete our mission without fire from the base. I'm starting to think that the sandstorm is awesome. I started to think the sandstorm is awesome. Oh crap. Hit reload. Hit reload. Ow. Oh god damn it, the fucking frogs again. Not a must. Man, I prefer the fucking Hectors. The fucking ball sucks. Oh, he's still alive. Here. Fencers are deployed to the right of the demolition team, and you guys will protect their life. Oh god damn it. Prepare to engage. Prepare to engage. Red drones. Teleportation ships. So I got one shot on the sniper. Lightning bow looks pretty good against them. I can't see shit, so... <coughs> okay, lightning bow, good. Plows of fall, bad. Yeah, the lightning bow is actually really, really good against them. Well done. Yeah, lightning bow is always good. Take it from here. No, oh, they got drop ships. We lose the sandstorm. They'll spray us with bullets. The sandstorm is gone. Hey, don't use bullets. Yeah, sillies. Oh, hey, it's the, uh... 
super, super base. We won't be able to approach the base. This is special mode. You surely be handy. The demolition team cannot approach All right, the base. You're going to get some. Take down the teleportation. You're yeah, walking in ant poop. Fire the missiles. This is the demolition team. Please get, get some, baby. Quickly. It's the enemy landing ship. <coughs> this is an area hit. Destroy the teleportation ship. There we go. The aliens are calling monsters here. You you to see that? What just happened? Looks like the aliens can control the monsters to a certain extent. We just found out that they can summon monsters from underground and Oh Jesus is a mess. <laughs> this is such a mess. I'll leave the rest to you. I don't have bullets. Pull the trigger. You can take down the aliens. Oh, it takes shoots a lot slower than it used to, but hey. A clean hit! Good job! Flying objects are closing in! Oh! You are! Thanks! We did it! We did it! You're gone! The sandstorm calmed down a little! Come on, open back up. Open wide, sucker! Oh crap! Get out of there! Look over there! Monsters! It's fine. Oh. Oh. So the aliens can control the monsters? I'll back you up! Oh, you wanna go, frog? If the operation succeeds, we will gain a tactical advantage. I'll chase you down with another one? I didn't even notice that one. If the demolition fails, we will destroy the base with heavy tanks. That's our target confirmed. Why are you helping your oppressor scooters? We have to get close <laughs> to the base to set up the bombs. Take down the enemies nearby. Hurry! I'm sure we make a move of this. Ah! Please designate targets. Hmm, that's not good. You're over here. Blew up my. But I drove away from the battle. <laughs> blow up my. Oh, you. I die already. Come here, frog. Sorry, you always fucking me up. Now I'm gonna fuck you up. Oh yeah, that's one right there. <coughs> Hello. Stop on that. Time to go to loot. I will use the Titans of your comrades as cover. We will blow it into pieces. Do you have Titans? Cool. We don't need the heavy tanks. No. We'll blow up this. We get Titans? No. It said Titan called in, but it's like no. The base is moving! Oi! What? It's moving! Wait, what happened? It's not the time for demolition! We haven't finished setting up the Is the base standing up? Yeah. We haven't set them up the bomb yet. Back off! Demolition team, retreat! Get away 
from the base. Hurry. No. We've super got so I got a tank. I'll attack it with a tank. Powered exoskeletons. Buy as much time as you can before the demolition team falls back. Are those legs? Oh. The base is walking. You don't say, Captain Obvious. Oh, it's over? What? I mean, there's still so many weapons and armor laying around. I know! God dang it, game. I got one more armor. I wanted loot! Oh, I got the negative <coughs> now. Sweet. Hey. Bulge. I got Bulge Laser B. Thunder Crossbow? <laughs> I got Powered Exoskeleton Z at Mix A. Okay. 180mm Laser... cannon. Plasma Cannon B. I have to look at something. The Ranger got a gun called an M1. Give me a frickin' Garand, please. I'll stop playing everything to use that. Oh, the damage potential of the spark fire increased. Not much. Yeah, that's better. Lightning bow can hold more. Energy cost is better. Let's go for a power wide range. Well, oh, then one Raven sucks. I got a submachine gun. Destroy the outpost. Plan B. Mm. Let's see if we're ready. Wait, what was that? Prototype of Sander. Okay, why we do this one? It's always very heavy tanks, launching artillery, strike and destroy that. Yeah, but we're gonna get it back off. Yeah, with the heavy unit. Okay, whatever. Hmm. I may guess it's got some range. I can try it. Here the air. Oh, oh, it's not that big a deal. Um, I mean, let's no. Oh, I'm working on I I gotta go to the bathroom real quick. Okay. So get done recording Halo 2, I might just do ODST and be like, this is the actual sequel to Halo 2, just don't know fool yourself. <laughs> <laughs> no idea what this is. I, I sold Halo 3 because Halo 3 is just god awful <clears throat> from beginning to end. I think I still have my, on my copy of Reach, I don't know if I still have ODST. I used to have Reach, 
didn't see it down in my drawer anymore. I was like, I probably got rid of it because they were like, oh, it's good. I got a one multiplayer. No, no, that's why I got rid of Reach. Is it the multiplayer? It's it's just Halo Three again, and I was like, seriously? I appreciate it. Yeah, it's horde mode or reusing whatever. Halo Three multiplayer that nobody likes because it wasn't Halo 2's multiplayer and it wasn't Halo One's multiplayer. It was it? It was like somewhere in between, and no one liked it. Well, it did it have mode creators or the, the Forge mode or whatever? Forge mode sucked. I know people had a lot of fun with when that bit. When anyway. they first brought it out, it was I was like, "This is your map making tool." This is weak. Well, I mean, considering it was on a console, you know. A console that has almost unlimited memory storage. Sure, it may have other... But then they're like, no, we're going to limit you to only using this many tools. It's like, well, nah, it may bro. have unlimited sto- Well, a lot of storage, but I mean, it's still constrained to what the system itself can actually do. I mean... Bullcrap. Because on the original Xbox, mm-hmm. when they put Operation Flashpoint on there... They tried to limit us to how much we could use in a map. Well, people found a, a quick code to where they could unlock the limiters on mm-hmm. it, and they would they could make missions as long and elaborate as they wanted after that, and the system could do it. And it was no problem, and nobody's, nobody was complaining about memory storage or anything. And people were making these really huge, like, almost like campaigns. And it was so much fun. It's so cool. Because it was the same mission builder that was on the PC version, just on the Xbox. Wasn't well, there a limit to how much stuff you could put in it, though? Considering, like... They, they put it on there, but there was actually a way to unlock the limiter. Oh, okay. And then you could do whatever. Because, I was going to say, at some point there's going to be so much... Huge maps on there. I was say, at some point there's going to be so much shit that, that you know, the, the system would just chug... The only time it started a chug, because I did one with the limiter on, is I, I remember it was a map that was called Kaboom. Mm-hmm. And it was basically, I made a Russian AA defense network a, uh, at middle of the night, because this game has gorgeous freaking uh, lighting effects and pyrotechnics. And it was actually an upgrade over the PC version. And I basically had like a bunch of shilkas and like BMPs and stuff sitting in this little basin. And I have like Apaches and A10 Warhawks f- over, flying over it, mm-hmm. and it was just in the middle of the night. It looked like Baghdad opening up. <laughs> it was so freaking awesome. And the goal was basically, you played as an American soldier, so the air units weren't attacking you. Mm-hmm. But the goal was walk across the basin without dying. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you're trying to evade uh, Soviet armored vehicles, but they're just trying to—they're just freaking out because they're trying to defend themselves against all the air power. So basically, you kind of want to just sit behind this one little rock, just above it. And I mean, sometimes you'd see like an airplane fall out of the sky, like right next to you, and <laughs> you flip over you and stuff. You're just sitting there going, "Oh my god, what's going on?" <laughs> <laughs> it was great. I mean, it was a simple little thing. It's like literally, it's like a hundred yard dash across this base, and it's like try to survive. And I'm just like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> and then a buddy of mine I mean there were there were so many ways to like set up uh, covert ops missions and all this other stuff oh god there were so many cool missions people were coming up with excuse me and then they put a couple of player made mods from the PC version on the Xbox version like you could get a sop with camel a world war one British fighter mm-hmm. you could fly around in that uh, so you could do dog fighting and then there was, uh... Oh, they also implemented a lean mechanic, which wasn't in the PC version. That was really helpful. But somehow they, they, they condensed the elaborate control scheme that the PC had onto the Xbox controller. And everything you could do on the PC version, you could do, but you had to use it on an Xbox controller. So it was pressure sensitive on a lot of stuff. Like, there was literally three different... Like, like your triggers... On the Xbox controller were three buttons. Mm-hmm. There was a light pole, medium pole, and long pole. And some of them were two or three buttons. I know, like, the left trigger was usually, like, three buttons worth. And the right trigger was a two button. Like, you could... You can, If you... Basically, if you lightly pulled your trigger, it would steady your aim. And then when you fought, did a full pull on it, it would do, like, a whole... It, it would then fire your gun. So you could actually get, like, a little bit better accuracy out of it if you did that. Hmm. There was, oh, it's, I, I've been wanting to do an LP of it, just even though I've already LP'd the game, but because it had new graphics and, and all that, the, the draw distance is garbage in it, but it's not 
terrible, it's just not good, because actually that system is running on half the specs of the PC version. And yet they somehow managed to make it work, and it runs well, and it plays well, and it actually the graphics are a little bit better overall than the PC version. <laughs> it's amazing, like, people, I remember they delayed the heck out of that game trying to get it on there. The only thing that's missing is the red. There's a Soviet campaign, but when people hacked the Xbox, they found it's the exact same PC files that are on the PC game. So they would take the red hammer disk, put it on their Xbox, and copy the files onto the hard drive into the Operation Flashpoint uh, files, and then put the Flashpoint disk in, and you could play the red hammer campaign on the Xbox. <laughs> Because actually I did that with the PC version. Because I had the Steam version. And I was like, oh, there's no Red Hammer. And then I went, wait a minute. I put the Red Hammer disc in there. I went, there's the campaign file. And I moved it over to the Steam file. And I could play the whole Red Hammer campaign. <laughs> Which I've been meaning to re-record that. Because for some reason I was recording it with XSplit back in the day. and It, it gave... Some of the videos have motion sickness, and I don't know why, because I would go back and re-watch them on my computer, and I'm like, they're fine, but when I upload them to YouTube, they'd be, like, waving around and stuff, and I'm just like, what? <laughs> it's the weirdest thing. Mm. There's the only game that ever did that. The enemy base is coming this way. Why are you all backing up? And Charge! No, we ain't falling back. We're going in. Oh, that's a leg. Boy, I was gonna land on that right. building. You dick. Boy. Drones are coming out from the base. Oh, for fuck's sake. Let them come. So where do we have to shoot this thing at? <laughs> I really should have expected drones. Oh, oh great, all my heaters. All my weapons come from above. The sniper team is behind us. Join up with them and fall back to where the heavy tanks are. Blew your arm off, how'd you like that? I've super got this. Oh gosh, they're dropping frogs right on top of me. This is not good. Oh god damn it. My worst enemy. Frogs. Slimy amphibians! They're battle toads! Uh. Disengage. Shit. Missiles now! Get behind the 
<laughs> Fuck you, frog. Heavy tanks. This is protect the inventory. Shooting a net. Let's talk to the ground forces. The bombing is over. Ground units, good luck. Uh oh. Oh, jeez, where'd you come from? The cannon of the base is attacking <gasps> us. Yeah. Move it, lady! It's raining now. We're under heavy fire! Our destruction is just a matter of time! Heavy tanks, attack! Oh, more drones, goody. Heavy tanks, aim at the enemy base. Uh. Oh, baby, a triple! Weapon with UFO sitting on it. UFO, move your fat ass! This is DE 202. This is Spencer 2! Engaging now! Dropping coordinates confirmed. There's no other way than getting rid of those aliens. Let's go! Oh, I got a way of doing it. Attack target confirmed. Container. Oh, Raggy. No! Don't hit me with the artillery! Oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck these foggy pieces of shit. I really need the Thunderbow against them. Worse than Bucky O'Hare. Right? Oh my god, the frame rate is gone. Is the frame rate? Yeah. And break through their defense. Laser cannons are activating. Die. Watch out for the enemy laser cannon. Ow, 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 stupid frog. Support vehicles will arrive any minute. Have the wounded get on the cars. It's a new vehicle. This is Ranger 16. We are in position. I like how the Megaly works in this one when you walk on. You gotta lock on and then fire. Die, frog! Oh, crap. No! I think I moved. This is carrier. It's an auto lock. Okay, it's got the lock. You foggy pieces! No. That's what I was going after. <laughs> they just eat 20 missiles? Yeah. And very much, very much range on the laser, though. Oh, 
Ah, something's trying to shoot at me. Aliens are coming out from the base! Again. Frogs don't like 180 millimeter cannons. No, I think it tears on the enemies rather than the base. <coughs> DE two zero two to air raids. I'll wait for instruction up here. Oh, mortar! Oh. Just the enemies. Uh, excuse me. That's first day. Oh, delicious loot. Scoop up all the armor. I'll let my pack recharge. Yeah, I can't stay on top of it. My mighty tank. The big beefy tanks are here. Attack yeah. Frick Blue Cannon, new crap, retreat! What the heck is that thing? The drones are coming. Some giant fat. I heard EDF go, WOG! Oh my god, my frames. Ah. We are in a critical situation. Our troops are faced with being completely wiped out. I still play. Aim the frogs. Well, drop it, god dang it. Oh dear. Ow. Hey, I'm so glad I'm the wing and air raider right now, so I don't have to try to run through that shit. Abort the attack on the enemy base. All units, focus on the enemies rather than the base. Why is it Oh my god, more frogs fucking this. So I was like, yeah, well, what? what are you talking about? We're fine. And then I saw the frogs, like, no. Focus on the enemies, not on the base. Yes, but the base just keeps teleporting them in from the ether. It's like Gauntlet. Yeah. Which game runs on Gauntlet? Really. Wing Diver needs food badly! Oh! Blue Air Raider is about to die. <laughs> oh. Wing Diver shot the food. <laughs> what happened to. <laughs> Shit. I used to play oh! Gauntlet. The way back in the day, Dad used to play Gauntlet with Mom, and she'd always shoot the potions of food. Why does that not surprise me? <laughs> uh, they did make it to the dragon on a regular occasion, though. I just remember playing Gauntlet on Xbox Live and just picking the warrior and pushing everybody and all the monsters to get them killed. <laughs> well, yeah, I think the, the warrior had, uh, had pushed by it. Might. Marty. Exploded by something. Like my vehicle to show yes. up, please. I got some of those froggy fucks, and the ship tried to blow me up. You're still alive. Die. Uh oh. 
Oh, it does save me because my pack was out of juice. This is the vehicle is on the go. There's a weapon. Retreat! Retreat! Oh my god, there's so much loot. Mission's about to end. Grab loot. Nope, now it's firing all kinds of lasers. I know, and it keeps slowing me down. More? It's firing all the pew pews. Okay, destroy the shit. I'll try and fly around and get stuff. Weapon, weapon, armor. Oh, hi. Big old pile over here. This rate, we will be wiped out. Infantry units, take down the surrounding enemies. You've already said it like a million times. Shoot them better. No. Target confirmed. He thinks you're all the explosions. Take down the enemies rather than the. Oh <laughs> my God! I think my PS4 might be melting. No, that's what I'm playing. No, that's true. Well, it's kind of. <laughs> There's at least some truth to it. This EA is garbage. Yeah. yeah. Fucking man. Oh well. My vehicle's dead. I don't know what's going on other than a lot of camera shake and lighting effects. Yeah, I turned the camera shake off. You pretty much have to. <laughs> Third camera shit. Appreciate the camera. Here's a weapon. Yeah, he turned camera shake off and then the fixed camera thing. Camera effects off. Well, camera effects are already off. Loot! Actually, well. Is that armor? Shabab, sucker! Could there were still enemies around, so I wasn't really focusing on it. Let's see, I got a blacker A1. B2 plasma core, rapid mirage up. Cold laser B, rocket cannon B, powered exoskeleton Nix A2. Master spark, master spark, T1 sword. Oh. ME2 emerald, ooh! Prototype the sander is up. Prototype the sander up. Well, okay. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Phalanx, eh. Bag blaster. Okay. Bolt shooter. That's A better. A millimeter smoothbore gun. This is all plaza can, don't care. <clears throat> Mirage, that's oh, way better. Oh, it's gonna fire some armor-piercing round, okay. ET Plasma Core... That's a lot of energy! Level, it's got a lot of charge, but... Eats up... Eats up with flying. Two Emerald... 